everybody, welcome back to EA Sports, continuing coverage of the postseason, and game number two is set to go. Really looking forward to this one tonight. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building, and we are underway. Mercy to conquer. The Red Wings carry the ball. From a bad angle. Oh, and the answer on that one. He's got a gift to read and anticipate the play, and when he drops into that butterfly position, not only is he as big as possible and covers the top half, but he's agile enough to slide across to cover the lower half. Detroit's got the puck in the defensive end. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. To the front! Oh, he caught all of that! What a save by Shesterkin! This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Makes it look easy with the stop. Picked up along the boards by Sider. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Still looking for our first goal. And they win the offensive zone faceoff. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Raymond's got it on the offensive end. The Red Wings played along the boards. Quick feed to Petrie. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Grabbed along the boards by Lindgren. New York's got it in their own zone. Trocek's going to play it against the half wall. To the low slot. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Gets a hold of the puck here in his own end. Picked up along the wall by Fabry. Sturkin. Look out! Oh, what a hit! Oh, what a save of the play! Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. As we look at that last save again, James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out-battle and out-will his opponent to find the puck. More than half the period has expired. The game is still scoreless. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. The Rangers have it from their own end. Moves it quickly over to Hito. And they clock it up at center. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Bear Britain. Great poke check on the reach. Here's a pass in front, and that's intercepted. The Rangers have it now. Receives the pass. Make a change. Make a Puck change. dumped in. The Red Wings have it now. Halls moving it ahead. Detroit's got the puck against the boards. And it takes a shot. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Shesterkin. Picks off the feed. Quick pass. Oh, what a chance here. Broken up. What a play defensively. Reads the play and forces the turnover. Dumps it in. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Detroit's got the puck in the own end. Poked away at center by Rasmussen. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. The Red Wings played along the wing. Blocked in front. Puck picked up by Flea. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. Along the wing up the neutral zone. And the officials will pass the sentence here. A tight 
game at the end of a period and you take a penalty, your PKers have to come up huge and get you to the intermission. Ability, which means he's fantastic at making those difficult passes to create the perfect chance for his teammates. Sider's defensive game is his primary focus, guys, but don't be surprised if he jumps in on the attack. One of these players is going to help give their team the upper hand tonight. Guys, back to you. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. The Rangers gain possession. Slides it diagonally to Kreider. Great positioning by the defender. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Listen, it's a tight game. It's late in the period. And you've taken a penalty. Now you got to stay in the present, stay in the moment, kill it off, and then you can reset in the intermission. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four-on-four -four action. Four-on-four. Four, you want to utilize north, south, east, west, and capitalize on the speed with the extra ice available. You can bet your coaching staff is going to put some pretty quick players out there. And a punch stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Here in the late goings of the period, still scoreless in this one. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. Poked away in the neutral zone by Gostas Bear. Scooped up along the wall by Panarin. Here's a short pass to Sabinajad. Big time stop. Great positioning by the goaltender. And he hangs on just as time runs out. All right, time to get a clean sheet of ice here as period number one comes to an end. As you heard the horn sound, we'll be back with much, much more as this is going to be a fun one. assess this game through the first 20 minutes played. So sirkin has been so dialed in right from puck drop, James, and it's a good thing he has been because he's faced a ton of rubber. Ryder standing up, ready to go. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Shoots it. Oh, how did he get a glove on that? What a stop by Husso. Rocks him. Miller's got the puck along the wing. Detroit's gained possession along the boards. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. The Red Wings gain control of it. Oh, and that closes him off against the wall. He's a power forward, and part of his game is delivery and executing hits. Well, he certainly did there. Moves the puck along the half wall. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. And they win that draw at center. Dabrinkit's moving the puck through his own zone. Lays into the body on the play. Solid check to slow him down. Dabrinkit's got the puck. The Rangers gain possession along the wall. Moves the puck. Quick pass across to Goodrow. Handles the pass. And that's off a stick. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Detroit's got a hold of the puck. Gains the zone through center. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Nearing the midway mark of the period. We're still scoreless. Oh, and he takes possession of the puck from off the wing with the centers all locked up there off the draw. 
Rollins with the poke chip by Hall. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Sometimes it's just a product of keeping your feet moving, and when you reach and you take your opponent's feet out, you're gonna get the two minutes for tripping. New York's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. The Red Wings have it against the wall. New York's ready to go on the attack. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. A shot! Love save and just enough of it. Puck grab by Wheeler. Scores! There it is! A power play goal! Well, your specialty team coaches are constantly telling you on a power play that you need to take advantage. And the way that you do that is to take away the eyes of the goaltender. A ton of net front presence here. And that's the reason the seeing eye shot finds its way to the back of the net. New York's rolling now, having taken a one goal lead here in the second. Well, yeah, they got to be a wave of momentum that continues to push and press now, James, as they seem to have control of the game right now. They can't give any momentum back to their opponent. Truva's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, singling penalty. Well, when you're looking for a goal, being shorthanded is not ideal. You're also killing valuable time where you can be pressing when you're PK. The Red Wings take possession off the faceoff. Beats the puck to top. And that's taken away in the offensive end by Zabinijad. New York's working hard in all areas of the ice. Defense is structure, and it needs to happen in all three zones. When you're talking about stick positioning, you're doing a great job of taking away passes. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. Paco's been on fire lately. Everything he throws at the net seems to be going in. When it's working for you, you got to be confident. You feel like nothing can go wrong. Detroit's got the win off that draw. New York's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Scores! And there's another power play goal! Wow! Well, practice makes perfect, and you know that they've been working on this in practice. They've got the right personnel. The coaching staff has showed them video of how they want it executed, and they deliver tonight. New York's now taking a two-goal lead here in the second. Well, that's a huge goal. That's going to give them a two-goal cushion. You can see the excitement on the bench right now. That's all it takes to have an impact. They put it in the net. Now they can take a deep breath and go play with creativity. Pokes it away in his own end. They gain the zone from the left side. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. Trocek's hauled down, penalty on the way. Oh, these home fans have had enough. They're wondering what a call's going the opposite way here, Cheryl. You can hear the frustration right now with that third call in a row, I might add, James. I mean, this is a one-sided game, isn't it? Unbelievable. The Redmonds win the draw. Looking for space inside the D zone. Shot! Oh, what a stop by Shesterkin! 
Taken along the wall by Lindgren. From his own end, he moves it up ahead. Great heads up play with the stick by Petrie. Sends it in front. Great defensive heads up play to pick it off. Change up, change up. Here's a chance in front. Tries to feed it over to Pedro. Takes the feed. Keeps possession on the play. Detroit's got a hold of the puck now. The Rangers grab possession to the puck. Passes on over to Hedo. Taken by Benito. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. There's the whistle, and here's the call. This is not the way they wanted the game to go. Just undisciplined, taking a ton of penalties. They'll have to reset and refocus if they want to find a way to get on top. Comfortable between the pipes, and he needs to settle in and find a way to create some momentum for his team. But on the other side of the puck, I mean, the Floreds have to contribute offensively, and they can only do that if there's a sense of urgency to their game. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. 
wanted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Works it across to Cobb. Quick shot. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Heedle's ready for the draw on this man advantage. Detroit's gonna start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Beardrin. Sensational stop by Shesterkin. Does a great job with some great pushes to get to the top of his crease and make the save from a high danger area. Quick feed to Wheeler. Beats the puck over. Off a stick and they can't connect. He got all of that one. The Rangers get a hold of it. On the attack along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Kako. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Slides it over to Mata. Being on the power play is a privilege. Trust me, I know I was never on it, always on the PK. So for those players who didn't execute, yes, they had a comfortable lead, and some would say it's not a big deal, but to each and every one of them, it should be. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Takes the feed. Makes a save. From the right side, takes the pass. Smart defensive play there. New York's looking to break out. From behind his own net. And a smart heads up play to poke that away by Cop. Here's a shot, and that's blocked away. Split feed. Along the half wall with the puck. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Great save from in tight. I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James, but man, he flashed the leather. He made the save, no rebound to boot. And he had the answer on that one. Passes over to Miller. Grabs it in his own end. New York's got it in their own zone. And now it's to Kako. And he handles a cross ice pass. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. Jostles the puck loose. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes it up center. Strong's the pure goal scorer, but he just can't find the back of the net tonight. They may have to consider an adjustment here because they really need one to get back. Oh my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Shesterkin's got the puck and hangs on for a whistle here in this third period. Well, he's been one of their best players all night. A reason why they're leading here in the third, James. But it's not just about the save. It's about managing the puck and making the decisions when to hold on. Trocek's won the draw here in the defensive zone. New York's moving it up the ice. At center ice now. He grabs the puck. Cuts to the front. Puck scooped up by Sider. Up along the wing. A chance in front! Tremendous stop by Shesterkin. He really owns the crease when he drops into that butterfly positioning. And for the shooter, I think it's intimidating. He makes himself as big as possible, and everyone knows he's athletic to boot. And now it's grabbed by Strong. Great stiff work as he pokes it away. Puck picked up by Kreider. Gaining steam inside the neutral zone. Nice feed from the left side up the middle. Slides the puck over. Trocek's got it in the offensive zone. Picked off by Husso. Comfort stick handling in his own zone. Picked up along the wall by Blee. Stars and Lopez again. They are really turning up the heat. Uh, so creative and free. And the reason why you can play free because you're playing with a ton of confidence. Not afraid to put the puck to the net and, of course, retrieve it. New York's been running away with this one since the beginning of the game. And no signs of slowing down in the third. It's been a productive night, and this is one of those games that gives everyone confidence, and this is important for your lineup as everyone gets it as they feel like they're contributing. Comfort's gaining momentum. Scooped up along the wall by Costas Bear. Slides it to Comfort. Puck exits the zone. Moves it quickly over to Bleed. The Rangers take it along the wall. 
angles it over to Dumba. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Here's a rip. Takes the puck. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Slides it diagonally to the brink it. Broken up at center by Dumba. Steps inside. And just hitting the final minute now in regulation of this blowout. From the left side, they gain the zone. Fires it on net. Oh, what a great save by Shesterkin. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. And that's knocked away by Petrie. Quick pass to Sabinashad. Detroit's got control of it now from their own end. Strong defensive effort. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. And a stiff break setup. Final horn sounds bringing this one to a close. A shutout victory evens the series. This is your kind of hockey, isn't it, Pounder? I love it, you know? Just looking back at your goaltender, knowing that they're making the difference and then giving you the confidence to play in front of them. And anytime you're in a series or in a big game, your goaltender has to be clutch, and that's exactly what happened. Large and in charge, the tender was tonight. Hope everyone had as much fun as we did here tonight. For all of us at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski saying peace.